Hey guys, this video will be on um, the pharmacology of nicotine. So as seen here, there's a ni the nicotine molecule. And it's approximated that each um, cigarette contains one milligram of nicotine. Just a fact. Um, so yeah, the way nicotine affects the brain is... Um, it... Um, it affects the brain by mimicking neurotransmitters. Basically, a neurotransmitter's chemical messenger um, allows brain cells to communicate. Each neurotransmitter is specifically designed to fit with a receptor on another nerve cell. Um, yeah, once the neurotransmitter locks into the receptor site, it activates the nerve cell and continues the message to the next cell. Um, Nicotine mainly mimics two neurotransmitters called acetylcholine and dopamine. Sorry if I pronounced anything wrong. Um, yeah. Um, the way it affects acetylcholine, I think, is um, once nicotine enters the body and makes its way to the brain through the bloodstream, um, one of the main areas that can attach itself to the receptor sites for acetylcholine. Um, Acetylcholine is a neurotransmitter responsible for a, a variety of bodily operations including breathing, heart rate, muscle movement and I um, can't remember, I think. Um, nicotine increases the activity of the receptor sites which is why many smokers feel an increase of energy or an increase in ability to concentrate directly after smoking a cigarette. Um, so yeah, that's the way it effect, affects acetylcholine. Um, it, the way it affects dopamine, I think, is by um, nicotine can also lock into the dopamine receptor sites. Dopamine is the neurotransmitter most known for feeling pleasure. Um, it is commonly referred to as the reward pathway of the brain. Dopamine is designed to release a good feeling every time you do something that benefits the body. As such, um, such as eating or exercising, it reinforces the mind to want to repeat that action at a later time. Um, the nicotine in tobacco produces um, products. Um, the nic in nic tobacco products creates the same pleasurable feeling, um, reinforcing the need to continue smoking or using other tobacco pro tobacco products. Um, it affects endorphins, I'm pretty sure. Um, I think it does trigger a release of um, endorphins in the brain. They're um, proteins that act as natural pain medicine for the body. Um, the, the more nicotine that enters the bloodstream, the greater potential for endorphins to be released. Um, with so many positive feelings... Um, associated in cells with nicotine use, such as the release of those chemicals. Um, yeah, I've seen here, I've got a drawing of a acetylcholine um, molecule, and here's one of dopamine. So, yeah, that's my video on um, pharmacology of nicotine. Stay tuned for pharmacology of caffeine, alcohol, THC, um, and other um, substances. So, yeah, please subscribe, rate, and comment.